welcome back to Petrohead TV and once again welcome back to my channel and a brand new video. So yeah, it feels like ages since I picked up these cameras and actually filmed a video for you guys. And you know what, during this lockdown and uh, not being able to go out and produce the videos I want to produce, it's really made me made me feel like this is definitely the thing I want to do for the rest of my life. This, this channel I'm so dedicated to, so watch out this year guys. Honestly, I'm going to put so much effort and so much time into this channel. Hopefully it bangs and we bring some amazing content for you guys to watch. And guys, I've lined up some cars for after lockdown has ended and some of these cars, mate, wait till you see them. Just wait until you see these cars and I promise you, this is my promise to you, I'm going to bring you some amazing car features. So just hold your horses, they are coming. So it's been a little while now, so I might as well give you all a channel update. So regarding the cars and stuff like that. So yeah, we're still in the big boy ML. Absolutely love this car. Absolutely beautiful thing. Um, perfect for the winter. Um, we took it out and had a little bit of fun with it the other day. I'll insert a clip right now. I've been waiting for this day for so long. Woo! Yeah, yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Wee. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, Mark. Come on, Mark. Come on, big boy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm absolutely loving this car. It's brilliant, it was amazing in the snow. Um, and yeah, it's, it's just got all the luxuries I need for a daily driver. Um, it ain't going anywhere. As you saw, I purchased it from Calvin's Car Diary. So, well, I purchased it from his company, Binka. So if you haven't uh, heard of Binka, I'll leave the link down there, there in, the, in the description for them. And uh, go and check them out. They've got a wide variety of cars, all the way from like cheap thousand uh, pound cars, all the way up to your high spec GTRs and stuff like that. So yeah, definitely go and check them out. Um, I'm absolutely in love with this car and I can't thank them guys enough. So yeah, this car ain't going anywhere. Future plans for it. Uh, the wheels are getting done very soon. Um, they're gonna be a similar color to the Civic. Um, there should be a shot on the screen right now. They're the Civic ones. Mine are gonna be similar to that on this, but with the silver spec instead of the bronze. Um, I let my partner have a bit of say in this as well because this is half her car as well. So uh, she gets a part deciding factor in that. Um, but they're gonna look amazing. And uh, I think we're gonna black the front grill out. Um, I like, you know me uh, by now guys. I love the whole murdered out look of a car. Uh, maybe some wind deflectors. We're just gonna make the thing stealth. Do you know what I mean? It's gotta be stealthed out. And that's the way I like it. Uh, update for the Civic. Civic is still sat at home, feeling a bit sorry for itself. It needs a bit of a detail. Uh, I've got my friend that's gonna come out and give it a, a nice once over. Um, I'll leave a link for him down there in the description as well. Go and check him out. Um, I've got some amazing plans coming for that car, which involves the person I am going to see right now. So I'm going to see my friend Anne, and uh, we're going to give this ML a little bit of a health check. I haven't seen what it looks like underneath. Uh, and then we're going to reveal to you his new project car. Um, and this is very, very exciting. Um, I'm gassed for this. This car will hit the channel when it's uh, fully built. If you want to follow the process, you have to check out my friend's channel, which is in the description again, which is Antec. Uh, go and show him all the love. Say Petro, the Petrohead family are here to support you in the comments. Uh, yeah, I'd appreciate that, guys. It mean a lot to me. He's my brother. He's, he's supported me. And uh, he's one of them people. There's been many people, but he's one of them people that have kept me going and kept this channel strong. So, yeah, if you could go and send him some love, I'd appreciate that. So, without any more waffle, I think it's about time we put our foot down in the big boy ML and go see Anne. Right guys, I've just arrived at Antec. His unit is just behind me and we're going to take the big boy ML and we're going to give it a bit of a health check. We're going to meet Ant, we're going to talk about what he's got going on and then we're going to go and see his project car and uh, yeah, his dream car. So let's get the car in the workshop.
man like ant, you know. <laughs> what are you saying, man? Yeah. It's been ages since you've been on the channel, hasn't it? For those of you, some of you are OG members may remember this guy from when we first did a video and he sold me the EP3. Which is my absolute baby. I miss that car. Yeah, it's so cool, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, this is the guy that's previous owner. And uh, yeah, so we've came here today uh, into your workshop and we're just yeah. gonna give the uh, bad boy ML a bit of a check over. But first things first, do you wanna explain like what, what you do here in that? Yeah, so I basically do anything from servicing, engine rebuilds on bikes, cars, um, anything really, of course. Yeah. Um, and just your basic servicing, brakes, so I can basically do it all. Or if nice. You're a project or engine conversions, on the buy basically. Awesome, yeah. yeah. And you also do like buy and sell and stuff, so yeah, this is yeah, one so of your buy and sells? This is one of my cars, I bought from an auction, a uh, few little issues, we're just trying to sort it out. So, um, obviously I've just started doing my own YouTube channel now, so. Of course, of course, so. Start doing like, uh, documenting the cars I buy and start fixing them and just basically see if I can make a profit from them or not. Yeah, man. So. Uh, for those of you that haven't checked out Ant's channel, please go and click down there. Um, his link to his channel will be down there. Go uh, show him some love. I already told you in the car anyway. All my uh, Petred family want you to support this guy as well because uh, he's been a big supporter of this channel, so it means a lot to me. But yeah, um, should we have a look around this ML then? So yeah, yeah, I haven't had this this long. I've had it for three months now. Um, yeah, and I thought I'd bring it to you for a quick health check. We'll go go around it, see if you spot any bits that need doing on it. Yeah, that's mm. fine. So what we do is we're gonna take this car out, and we'll put it on the ramp, and I'll do a full, I'll do three health checks. So if you've got any bike squads or cars or anything like that, that you have any issues, just give me a message. I can book you in, not a problem. I can do a free check over, make sure everything's all right. If you've got any issues, noise wise, I can check it out, not a problem. So let's get your car on the ramp, and we'll take it up in the air, and we'll see if we can find anything wrong with it. Cool. Yeah, so like Ant said, if you uh, do fancy a health check and you are in like the local area, that we're based in Berkshire here in Bracknell, um, the address for Ant's unit will be down there as well. So if you do need a health check like I'm doing with my car now, then uh, don't hesitate in contacting Ant and uh, yeah, he'll sort you out. So yeah, let's get this car on the ramp. Right, we've got the car on the ramp behind me, but during the health check, Ant has spotted something, and I think we've got a little oil leak, so if we come under here, we're gonna have a look. So, in between the gearbox and the See engine. here. On all here. So, let's take the tray off and have a look, see what we can find. Yeah. So what do you reckon, from the gearbox, or? Uh, it's hard to tell at the moment. Yeah. Right, so under here, we've just found, it hasn't come out very well on camera, but yeah, you can see all the oil residue around there. Uh, yeah, doesn't look too good to me. <laughs> um, so yeah, what, what's the plan now, Ant? We're gonna well, get the car um, down, have a look? So we're gonna bring the car down, just to see if, because obviously it looks like it's leaking in between the gearbox and the engine, but there could be a chance that it could be leaking from the oil cooler up top and leaking its way around. So we'll just have to bring the car down, we'll check everything underneath first, bring the car down and then we'll see if we can see any sort of oil leaks that could be working its way down. Yeah, alright, let's do that. So there's an oil leak up here also, so it's hard to, to know if it's actually leaking from all the way up here all the way down, yeah. or if it's actually leaking in between the engine and gearbox from the crank seal or not. Mm. Um, I was hoping to see a bit more, but where your inlet manifold is ear enough in the middle, yeah. you've got to take all that off and everything out just to see if it's leaking there or not. We can see oil down here, yeah. but obviously it's not exactly like a two minute job, you know. Yeah. It's a lot of work just to rectify where it's coming from. So I'm going to put a plus side to this. So basically, in the next month or so, I'll bring the Civic back out. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> and we'll drive that for a bit. My good friend Ant might have the uh, horrible job of yeah. doing this car. But yeah, I think it needs doing. So within the next month or so, I think we should get the Civic back out and um, we'll sort this out. But yeah, nothing to cry about. We'll get it sorted. But um, yeah, we'll go from there. Other that. than that, the car's all good. Just this is small issue. Yeah. Same so, issue. Could be a big issue. We don't know. Yeah. Um, and I do love the car. So it's, it's a nice car. Really yeah. Nice. Yeah. Really clean, nice car. Yeah. So we'll get it sorted anyway. Right, so we've just finished checking over the big ML with Ant. Um, does need a little bit of work, I think, but it's not much of a problem. We'll get it sorted. Um, hopefully, not, it's not going to financially ruin me. But yeah, anyway, big ML's fine apart from that. We're still going to drive it around for a little bit. Uh, and then we'll probably get the Civic out. But I think uh, we should go and reveal Ant's new car. And this is his dream car. So yeah, let's go into the reveal. And I'll see you in a sec. Got my squad chilling in the Corsa Lakes. It's Lakes on the beat Lakes on the beat Hold on, I know what you're thinking. This is just a course to see, right? And you're all, you're wasting my time, Dan. Why am I watching this? Well, this is Ant's project car. This isn't his dream car, but it's going to be his dream car. So let's just have a quick look under the bonnet. So there's no engine currently, but let me show you what I'm doing to this. This is going to be the plan for the uh, the bad boy course to see. So what's going on, mate? So it's not much of an engine at the moment. Um, it's actually better to go to the machine shop. See, most of the other bits are my uh, lovely shell. All stacked up, yeah. Um, so, literally, I'm going to take this to the machine shop, get some stuff done. So, if you want to see me strip this engine down and explain a bit about the engine, then you need to go to my channel and watch part two. Or if you want to watch part one as well, go ahead and watch that. And then you'll see more in depth of what I'm actually doing. Yeah, so guys, if, if you do want to go into more depth with this car and the build, you do need to head over to Antec. Uh, and he's going to explain everything that he's doing and that's more or less why he's doing the channel really so you can have fun with project cars and that so yeah so head over there so head back over to Ant's channel and uh, don't forget to leave a subscribe as well and a cheeky comment from uh, the Petred family I'm sure he'd appreciate that but yeah I think that's it really isn't it um, again if anyone fancies any uh, work doing don't forget to hit up Ant um, like he said, he'll give a free health check like he's just done with the Mercedes today. He saved me a lot of uh, hassle because if something went wrong in the long run, then it'd be more expensive for me. So it's really good that he provides this service. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'd leave all his stuff in the description below. And go check him out and uh, follow his uh, YouTube uh, journey. So I think that's it. We're going to wrap up the video here. There's not really much else to show you. So I've showed you Ant's project car. That's going to be really interesting, like I said. And like Ant said, go over to his channel and you'll see more about that. We've obviously had the Merc looked at and um, we have got a bit of an oil leak. So we do need to address that at some point. And uh, so we'll probably get the Civic back out again soon, which will be fun. Um, like I said, don't forget to check out Antec. Um, he'll give you a free health check. Uh, and make sure your car is all safe and sound but again thank you to everyone who sp supported the Petrohead TV movement uh, it really means the world to me that you all continue supporting me um, we've just hit I think 810 subscribers today um, so yeah thank you guys it means so much to me the goal obviously is to still hit that 1k and I'm going to do a really nice giveaway so I'm thinking like a really nice detailing kit like £100 worth like maybe a bit more so yeah I, I do really want to give back to you if you have any suggestions of what to do in a giveaway please let me know and um, I'll be sure to do it so yeah thank you guys really appreciate it don't forget to click that like button it really helps these videos out uh, subscribe if you haven't already uh, don't forget to follow me on Instagram to follow all the behind the scenes action and I'll see you all very very soon bye There's lakes on the beach.